Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for August 13th. So, let's get started. First day in history! <laughs> On this day in history, August 13th, 1860, Annie Oakley was born. She was a sharpshooter and performer. As a youngster, Oakley learned to shoot a rifle in the woods of Dark County, Ohio. Her career as a sharpshooter started at age 17 when she defeated the noted marksman Frank E. Butler at a competition in Cincinnati, Ohio. She traveled with the Buffalo Bill Wild West Show for 17 years. A railroad accident in 1901 partially paralyzed her, but she continued to perform until her death. Also, on this day in 1942, Walt Disney's animated feature Bambi premiered at the Radio City Music Hall in New York. And on this day in 1982, Shani Davis was born. In 2002, he became the first African American to earn a spot on the U.S. Olympic speed skating team, but he did not compete. But in the 2006 Winter Olympics held in Turin, Italy, he won a gold medal in the 1,000 meter race and a silver medal in the 1,500 meter race. World Power! Today on Word Power, we're going to talk about the word enthusiasm. If you feel enthusiasm, you feel deep excitement and passion about something you're doing. If you love to play soccer and learn new skills, you practice each new move with great enthusiasm. You know, the word enthusiasm originally comes from the Greek words en, theos, which means in God. The Greeks thought someone with enthusiasm was inspired by God. Today on Extremes, we ask, what is the greediest animal on the planet? Well, you may have your own opinion, but the larva of the polyphemous moth eats 86,000 times its birth weight in its first 56 days of life. All right, most human babies weigh about seven pounds, which is 3.2 kilograms when they're born. If a human baby ate as much as the polyphemous moth larva, by the time the baby was two years old, it would weigh over 600,000 pounds or over 272,159 kilograms. Wow. Health tips. <laughs> Never touch or play with chemicals and household cleaners used by your mom and dad. You see, even ordinary household cleaners can be extremely dangerous. If they accidentally splash or spill or spray into your face and eyes, they can cause painful and permanent injury. You know, even if the label says they will not hurt your skin, they can still cause serious burns to your eyes. Before the signing of the Constitution, America was made up of 13 colonies ruled by England. Following the Revolutionary War, these colonies, although they had formed a League of Friendship under the Articles of Confederation, basically governed themselves. They feared a strong central government like the one they lived with under England's rule. However, it was soon discovered that this weak form of state government could not survive, and so the Constitution was drafted. The Constitution defines and limits the power of the national government, defines the relationships between the national government and the individual state governments, and guarantees the rights of the citizens of the United States. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow.